It was a special day in Tigertown over the weekend as Clemson played their home opener against South Carolina State. After a difficult 2020 season and limited capacity fans in Death Valley, two classes of Clemson players experienced the most exciting 25 seconds in college football, charging down the hill Saturday night amongst 80,000 fans. Yeah, it was definitely more than I, I expected. Uh, you know, just riding around that bus and, and seeing everybody in the stadium. Um, you know, you, you really can't even even dream about it. Uh, it's something that you just got to see and you got to you got to go through it. It, it was it was probably the coolest experience that, that I've had since I I've I've gotten to Clemson. And uh, you know, just you know, rubbing that rock, running down the hill, and, and going to pray in the other uh, in the other end zone is is something that I'll remember for the rest of my life. Falling on the 20th anniversary of 9-11, Clemson honored all the lives lost and paid tribute to the Clemson graduates whose lives were taken. As if this day couldn't be any more memorable, former Clemson player and now coach C.J. Spiller was honored during halftime for his induction into the College Football Hall of Fame, surrounded by his family and the entire Clemson community. I truly don't think it's really not going to hit me until December 7th, to be honest with you. Um, it's, it truly is an honor. Uh, to be uh, be getting inducted with so many great players and coaches, not only for me, but you know, for for this university, for for our fans, for my family. Last week, offensive coordinator Tony Elliott said he looked forward to balancing the running and passing game, and that's exactly what we saw from the Clemson offense collecting over 200 yards, both in the air and on the ground. You know, it was good to get those guys some touches uh, and give them, give them an opportunity. And I thought they, uh, thought they, they, they ran hard. Uh, I thought they did a good job of, for the most part, of, of, of finding, the, uh, finding the creases. Uh, offensive line did a good job of creating some holes for them. Uh, but I think it's too early to tell, you know, if there's if they're separation yet. Uh, but those guys, you know, those guys made the most of their opportunities. And we got to build off of that, build off the confidence that we established uh, running the football and see can we carry that forward uh, week to week. This week, the Tigers prepare for their first in-conference matchup against Georgia Tech. Here in Clemson, Julia Haskins, the Clemson Insider.